Good morning, everyone. Today's devotion from Psalm 122 is about learning to rejoice in the Lord's house. Because it says in Psalm 122, verse 1, I rejoiced with those who said to me, let us go to the house of the Lord. Now, this psalm is a celebration of the Holy Temple, the house of the Lord, and a prayer for the holy city of Jerusalem as the place where God is worshipped. But let me ask you, where is the house of the Lord today? Is it a building or a place? Well, Paul answers this question plainly and simply in 1 Corinthians 3, verse 16. Don't you know that you yourselves are God's temple and that God's spirit lives among you? God's house today is not a building, it's a people. Because of what Jesus did at the cross, God dwells in the hearts of those who love him. His presence is not in the centre of a building, but at the heart of humankind, of those who love him. So I wonder, do you rejoice at going to be with God's people? Just like David rejoices at going to the physical place of God's house in this psalm. The church might not look particularly pretty. It might not be as ordained or as pretty as a, an Old Testament temple. People will say and do wrong things all the time. And things might not be to your preference. But is it worth it if God is there in the midst of the mess? Today, I encourage you to encourage a Christian, if it's possible, to spend time with other Christians by phone or in person, ideally. And perhaps you too can then rejoice in the Lord's house.